Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see about structure, types and functions of teeth. With the help of a tooth, person can chew, speak and smile. Teeth gives shape to our face. Each type of tooth has a name and a specific function. Teeth are made up of different layers. They are enamel, dentin, pulp, cementum, gingiva, alveolar bone, nerves and blood vessels. Let's see them one by one in detail. Enamel. Enamel is the hardest white part of the tooth. It is on the outside of the tooth. Enamel is mostly made up of calcium phosphate and rock hard mineral. Second layer underlying the enamel is dentin. It is a hard tissue that contains microscopic tubes. When the enamel is damaged, heat or cold can enter through these parts and can cause sensitivity or pain. Pulp is the softer, deepest living inner structure of the tooth. Blood vessels and nerves run through the pulp of the teeth. Next is the cementum. Cementum is a layer of connective tissues that binds the roots of the teeth firmly to the gums and the jawbone. Next comes the gingiva. Gingiva is attached to the adjacent alveolar bone and to the cementum of each tooth by fiber bundles. It is generally called gum. Alveolar bone. The jaw bone supporting the tooth, the tooth is planted into this bone. When a large part of the alveolar bone is destroyed by periodontal disease or other causes, the tooth becomes loose. Nerves and blood vessels. The root contains blood vessels and nerves which supply blood and filling to the whole tooth. Now let's see the types of teeth. Humans have the following types of teeth. They are incisors, canines, premolars and molars. Incisors. Incisors are the sharp teeth at the front of the mouth that bite into food and cut into smaller pieces. They are flat with a thin edge. They are also called anterior teeth. Both children and adults have 8 incisors, 4 central incisors at the front of the mouth, 2 on each row. Canines Canines are the sharp pointed teeth that are next to the incisors. Canines are the longest of all the teeth and it is used to tear the food. Both children and adults have four canines. Children usually get their first permanent canines between the ages of 9 and 12. Premolars. Premolars are bigger than the incisors and canines. They have many ridges and help chew and grind up food. Adults have 8 premolars. The first and second premolar are the molars that are next to canines. Young children do not have premolar teeth. These first appear as permanent teeth when children are 10 to 12 years old. Molars are the biggest of all the teeth. They have a large flat surface with ridges that allow them to chew food and grind it up. Adults have 12 permanent molars, 6 on the bottom and top jaw and children have 8 primary molars. 
wisdom teeth the last molars to grow are wisdom teeth they usually come in the ages of 17 and 21 they grow at the end of the row of teeth near the jaw people do not need these teeth for chewing and they are difficult to keep clean because of their position far back in the mouth